and welcome back to Mr. John's story time. And this story is about a little old lady who thinks her house is a squash and a squeeze. Yes, it is. A squash and a squeeze. Let's have a look. What animals do you remember is in this story? A little old lady lived by herself with a table and a chair and a jug on the shelf. A wise old man heard her grumble and grouse. There's not enough room in my house. Please, old man, won't you help me, please? My house is a squash and a squeeze. <gasps> Taking your hen, said the wise old man. Taking my hen? What a curious plan. Well, the hen laid an egg on a fireside rug and flapped around the room, knocking over her jug. Uh-oh. The little old lady cried, what should I do? It was pokey for one and now it's tiny for two. My nose has a tickle and there's no room to sneeze. My house is a squash and a squeeze. And she said, wise old man, would you help me please? My house is a squash and a squeeze. Taking your goat, said the wise old man. Taking my goat? What a curious plan. Well, the goat chewed the curtains and trod on the egg, then sat down to nibble the table leg. Uh-oh. The little old lady cried, golly me. It was tiny for two and it's titchy for three. The hen pet the goat and the goat's got fleas. My house is a squash and a squeeze. And she said, wise old man, won't you help me please? My house is a squash and a squeeze. Uh oh no. Taking your pig, said the wise old man. Taking my pig? What a curious plan. So she took in her pig who kept chasing the hen and raided the larder again and again. Uh-oh. The little old lady cried, Stop! I'm in floor! It was titchy for three, and it's teeny for four. Even the pig in the larder agrees. My house is a squash and a squeeze. And she said, Wise old man, won't you help me please? My house is a squash and a squeeze. Taking your cow, said the wise old man. Taking my cow? What a curious plan. Well, the cow took a look, one look and charged straight at the pig, then jumped on the table and tapped out a jig. Oh, cows don't jig. The little old lady cried, heaven's alive! It was teeny for four and it's weeny for five. I'm tearing my hair out. I'm down on my knees. My house is a squash and a squeeze. <gasps> and she said, wise old man, won't you help me please? My house is a squash and a squeeze. Take them all out, said the wise old man. But then I'll be back where I first began. She opened the window and flew out the hen. That's better, at least I can sneeze again. She shooed out the goat and shoved out the pig. My house is beginning to feel pretty big. She huffed and she puffed and she pushed out the cow. Just look at my house, it's enormous now. Thank you, old man, for the work you have done. It was weeny for five, it's gigantic for one. There's no need to grumble and there's no need to grouse. There's plenty of room in my house. And now she's full of frolics and fiddle dee It isn't a squash and it isn't a squeeze. Yes, she's full of frolics and fiddle dee It isn't a squash or a squeeze. And that, children, is the end of that story. I hope you've enjoyed that one. Stay tuned for more. Bye.